I'm Sean Riley, Mr. Packadelphia himself. And in each episode, you'll hear from your peers about the value they've obtained from attending previous Pack Expo East, as well as some exciting things to do if you catch a break from the show floor. On today's episode, we hear from previous Pack Expo East attendee Christian Prickett from Spartech Plastics about the value he found from attending a previous PAC Expo and why it makes this regional event a show that can't be missed. If you ask me, should I attend PAC Expo East? The answer is yes. There's so much to see and do along with all the new innovations. How are you gonna get this all in one place? You can't see this on the internet. You have to see it in person. If you're looking for a quick cultural experience after exploring the latest packaging and processing innovations on the show floor, Philly has you covered. Today's stop is the Benjamin Franklin Parkway, named for lover of all things French, Ben Franklin, and Philadelphia's Dodd to sister city Paris's Avenue des Champs-Élysées. Home of the Philadelphia Museum of Art and its world-renowned Rocky Steps, the Barnes Foundation Museum for those with an appreciation of art and horticulture, the Rodin Museum that contains one of the largest collections in the world of sculptor Auguste Rodin's works outside of Paris, and Philly's prestigious science museum, the Franklin Institute, are all a quick walk or cab ride away from the Pack Expo show floor. See for yourself March 21st through the 23rd at the Pennsylvania Convention Center when nearly 7,000 attendees and 400 exhibitors come together to offer real-world solutions to the latest packaging and processing challenges. Visit the Pack Expo site to see who will be there and easily search by product category, keyword, or industry to help find exactly what you need. For more information and to register, visit PackExpoEast.com. See you in Philly and see you online at Packadelphia.